Namaste. Welcome to Math with Ushi uh, and Agastya Gurukulam. Today is 14th March, uh, which is called the Pi Day because it is written as 314. Uh, do you know that the earliest known written expression of Pi is found in Aryabhatiya, a text that was written around 499 common era by a 23-year-old Aryabhata. He says, Vritta Vyasa Paridi Sambandaha. Vritte means um, of a circle. Vyasa is the diameter and the Paridi is the circumference of the circle. So what is the relationship, Sambandaha, between the diameter of the circle and the circumference of the circle? So he says the formula, Chaturadhikam Shatamashta Gunam Dvashashtih Tatha Sahasranam Ayutta Dvaya Vishkam Bhastya Asanno Vritta Parinaha. So he says, Chaturadhikam Shatam means, Shatam means 100, uh, Chaturadhikam means plus 4. So 104 times 8, Ashtagunam, multiplied by 8. So you get 832. And then Tatha, so you have added to Dvashashti Sahasranam, 62,000. So 62,832. Ayutta Dvaya. So Ayutta is 10,000. Dvaya is 2 times. So you get 20,000. Vishkam Bhasya of the diameter of the circle. Asannaha approximately. Please note this point. He says it is approximate. We know that pi is an irrational number. And only a rational number can be expressed in the form of a ratio between two integers. So he says it is approximate because we know that Pi is an irrational number. It cannot be expressed as a ratio of two integers. And then he says, Asano Vritta Parinaha. So Vritta is a circle and Parinaha is the circumference again. So the shloka expresses the fact that the ratio of the circumference of a circle to the diameter is approximately 62,832 divided by 20,000, which gives an, as a value of 3. 1416. I hope you found this interesting. Namaste. Danyavadaha.